This video will help you change a responsible person in the charity portal. For ACNC purposes, the term responsible person means a member of the charity's governing body. For most charities, this is likely to be the directors, committee or board members, or trustees. Once you have logged into the portal, you can change a responsible person by clicking on the Change Responsible Person button on the left-hand side of the screen. This page here will display the name and positions of all the current responsible persons listed for your charity. These details will also be listed on the Public Charity Register. On this page, you can either remove a responsible person if they are no longer part of the charity's governing body, or edit the position of an existing responsible person if they have taken on a new role. Simply click on the links here and then follow the prompts. If you want to add a new responsible person, click the grey Add a Responsible Person Now button. This page has some tips and guidance that we recommend you review before making the changes. Once you are ready to proceed, click on the Add Responsible Persons Now button. To start adding a new responsible person, click on the Add New Record link here. You will then need to add the details of your new responsible person. Although the form requires certain personal information of the responsible person you are adding, such as their address and phone number, the Charity Register will only display a responsible person's name and position. You will also need to provide a date of when the responsible person commenced and indicate if you have searched for this person on the ASIC Register of Banned or Disqualified Persons. Once you have finished typing in the details, click Save and close the window, or Save and New if you have more responsible persons to add. Your new entry or entries should now appear in the table. Be sure to read our privacy statement before submitting the changes. To complete the change, click the Submit button at the bottom of the page. This is an important step to remember. If you don't click the Submit button, the change will not occur. Once submitted, you will see a message indicating that the change has been successful. Please note that there is sometimes a short delay between changing the information in the portal and it appearing on the Charity Register. And that's it! If you have any questions or need any further assistance changing a responsible person in the portal, you can contact our Advice Services team on 132262 or email advice at acnc.gov.au. I hope this has been useful and thanks for watching.